Hey guys, let's start to the video. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing another Shop My Stash. The voice that you heard before was my son, which is so adorable. But it's going to be a quick one. I just got back from the gym. Ow, new year, new me. I'm here. I just don't... You don't want to see this. But, um, so it's going to be a quick one. Oh, I got to clean this. It's going to be a quick one just because I'm not going to go through every single compartment because some of the stuff is just going to stay the same. My kids are here, so they are fighting. Yep, 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 they're fighting. Anyways, so it's going to be a quick one because I did just come back from the gym and I need to go take a shower, but I didn't film this yesterday, so I got to hurry up. Let's begin. So everything in this drawer is honestly going to stay the same. It's just eyebrows, mascaras, and a concealer. Everything in this drawer is just going to stay the same as well. As well as this one. So it just has my BB cream, my face powder, a liquid highlighter, and a Fenty matchstick. Now the one we're going to talk about is this one. So I mentioned that any lipsticks I use, I will just include... I think the only lipstick that was in here was the Wet n Wild one, so let's talk about it. This NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, it is pretty, but I'm going to take it out. This Matte Lipstick in Nutmeg, so beautiful, and it is a mini. I don't even know, yep. Oh, my hand looks so big. Oh my god. Anyways, so beautiful. I'm going to take that out as well. So I do have two ABH liquid lipsticks. One is in Trouble and one is in Starfish. I'm actually going to keep these in there because these are in my Use Those Liquid Lipsticks or Use Those Lippies or Lipstick Roulette, whatever it's called. So I'm going to leave those in there. But I'm going to take this small, tiny Sephora one out. I always keep it in every single week. Um, every single time I do these, because I'm like, oh, it's small, but I'm going to put it somewhere else. So I have this uh, Wet n Wild contour stick. I don't know. I kind of want to see if I could use it. Um, I want to start learning how to contour my nose, but I'm not 100% sure. But for right now, I'm going to leave it in there. Everything in here is basically staying the same. These are stuff in Project Pants. And most of the stuff is in here is staying the same, although we are going to talk about some things. All right, this is the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Brown Bow Face Palette. I used Princess Cut and then I used the Enhanced. I like this a lot. I don't think it looks muddy at all. It looks really, really nice. It could be because I used one of the lighter shades. So I'm going to take this out just because I have other face palettes that I want to try to get used of. But if it was up to me, I'll keep it in. But I'm really going to try my hardest to like rotate through any everything. And if I want to use this again, I could just rotate it through another time. But I'm taking this out. This Becca palette, it's so reflective. So I'm sorry. I'm trying to like, you know. But the Becca palette, um, this is with Chloe and Malika. Yeah, this is with Chloe and Malika. I'm taking this out, so I actually didn't even use the highlighter. I just used the blush and the bronzer a lot. Um, but I, I did like it, but I'm going to take it out. This is the Warrior 2 palette. It is my one week one palette. Honestly, I did use it. I like it. I feel like I have these shades in other palettes. Sorry if that one's like so bright. But I have these shades in other palette. For now, I'm going to keep it. Um, but I did do a look and I really enjoyed it. But I'm going to take that out too because I have to add in another one week one palette. And then this ColourPop um, Super Shock Shadow. So beautiful. Oh my god, you get it, Missy? But I hit pan on it. Maybe if I pour it like this. Whatever, you guys going to have to bear with me because I'm using the camera and I'm still trying to get the lighting settled. But I did hit pan on it. Um, I did a look that I really, really enjoyed. It is on my Instagram, so you should definitely check it out. Although, it wasn't the best picture, but I have a video coming up with that look in it. So it looks really, really beautiful. Everything else is going to stay in here besides this mascara. So... Let's talk about this mascara. I got this in a boxy charm. This is the Petite and Pretty um, mascara. I don't like it. I don't like it because it transfers to my lower lash line or, you know, the bottom underneath my eye. And it just looks 
black and smudged out so I'm removing this I'm just going to keep these two mascaras in here which is the pixie and the Tarte big eagle mascara and I'm gonna remove this I'm gonna try again another time with this mascara but if it does it to me again it did it to me three times already if it does it to me again I'm done all right guys so for my one week one palette I actually got the sweet talk palette so I'm kind of happy I got this palette because I never used it I'm so ashamed to admit but I have not used this palette I don't know if you can see it's true color um, because the lighting but it's a really really pretty palette um, but I will be using this for the week I'm kind of like sad though because I have these shadows in my Pandals eyeshadows but for my one week one palette, as long as I use it two times, that's all that really matters to me. So that is my one week one palette. So pretty. Look at the packaging. Okay, so just quickly, if it's moving, it's because I'm holding the camera. This highlighter, I said I was going to use it five times and then take it out. The only reason why I haven't spoken about it is because I only used it once. So I only use... So I only used this highlighter one time, so that's why I haven't said anything about it. So I still have four more times to use it. And now let's pick out some stuff. Alright, so here is where some of my face palettes are. I'm holding the camera, so hopefully it's not too blurry. And I'm trying my hardest not to move it. For my face palette that I'm going to use this week, I'm actually going to pull in... Girl... These are a lot of stuff that I haven't used. If the camera is a little bit off, I'm sorry, but I'm holding the camera and, you know, it is a struggle. So the face palette that I'm pulling in today, I mean for the week, is the Too Faced Natural Face Palette. I think I've seen this in Monica's um, Shop My Stash and I was like, oh my god, I miss it. Um, I have it and I want to use it. So I'm not going to pull a highlighter palette in this week. But next week, what I'm going to do is pull in single blushes and single bronzers. And then I'm going to pull in a highlighter palette so they could get used to. I did use this before. It looks brand new, which is so sad. I think I used this highlighter a couple times. But, um, yeah, so that's going to be the face palette that I'm bringing in. As always, I did transfer it to my phone. You are going to see a little mess behind me. Yo, it is what it is. So I'm not even going to complain. This is not even cleaned. Um, so basically, as I was saying, I'm going to put this Super Shock Shadow in Kelp Me. This is what it looks like. So I'm going to be using this face palette um, this week. Once again, just wanted to show you. Um, and then I do have two primers in Project Pan. So it is the Fenty Beauty Primer and the Primerizer. But I still want to take out another primer. Just because, you know what? I can at least use the other primer. Um another day oh my god i don't like the way the stain looks but sorry that's just the contour stick the primer that i'm going to pull in is this elf puff puff primer so i forgot the claims of this because i threw away the box but um this is what it is um and this is the primer i'm going to be testing out okay so for li like a lip balm i'm just going to bring in this lippy balm from ColourPop. This is from their Peach Palette Collection, I believe. Yeah. So I know that I'm not basic like I'm not showing you in my drawers and all that stuff and but this is like really 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 quick. I wasn't going to put in a highlighter cuz I did say I was going to use that five times and I was thinking about lying, but I was like no because I'm not going to lie to you guys. I only used it once. I don't think I really like it. But I only used it once. So let's just go over some stuff again. Okay, so I had this foundation in. I used it. I thought I didn't like it, but I think I do. I think it was just a sponge. I do want to test it out some more to see if I truly like it. But I want to switch it out this week because I used the Dose of Colors um, foundation. I'm in the shade 117 Light Medium, and I loved it. I actually start school tomorrow. So, um... I want to use this because I want to see how it wears throughout the day. A lot of people really love this, so I'm putting this one in. Also, for concealer, I have been using the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define. I did have to take the stopper out. Let me see if I can open it. Oh, oh what? What happened? Anyways, I guess I can't open it. 
whatever um i did have to take the stopper out but i do want to put in another concealer just to give some open ones some love so i'm going to put in this elf i mean oh my god this jeffree star concealer i'm in the shade c7 the star actually broke oh it is what it is it's okay so i'm gonna put in the concealer as well so i'm gonna be using both um matter of fact I could take this one out for a week. It's not a big deal. And I'll just use the Jeffree Star Concealer. Like, I'm so close to finishing this. But, you know, once you take the stopper out, like, it's so much product that's left in. Um, So, but I did take the stopper out. I'm going to be using that. But I'll lay off of it for a week. And I'll use the Jeffree Star Concealer. I'm also going to bring in the e.l.f. blotting sheets. Because, like I said, I do start school tomorrow. So I'm only there for one class, to be honest, and I'm going to the gym after. Um, but Tuesday and Thursdays, I'm there for a couple hours. So I figured, you know what? Why not? So I'll put that in my bag as well. I'm also going to put this moisturizer, this e.l.f. Glow Radiant Moisturizer. It does have an SPF of 15. I honestly like it. Now, I don't think that 15 is enough. I'm not going to lie to you. So I do put a little, another different one by Pure Perlis. Perlis. Um, but I still really, really enjoy this. It is a good moisturizer. I think it's only like eight bucks. All right, guys. So I hope this is going to come out good because it is on my phone. So the lighting might be a little bit off, but it is what it is. So basically, yeah, everything's in here. The concealer, the lippy balm. I'm actually going to put the lippy balm in my bag and the blotting sheets in my bag. I didn't add anything to that. I added the primer in here. The lipsticks I'm going to leave in here, but whatever lipsticks I use throughout the week, I will include them. That way you guys could be able to see um, which ones I use for the week. I didn't add anything in here. So I didn't add anything in here. Everything is basically the same. In here, I just added my face palette. I'm also hoping that I can actually use this because I haven't even used it yet. Um, and then the eyeshadow palette is just going to go on my vanity. All right, so the super shock shadow is actually going to go in here too. It is messy. And then the prime, the glow lotion is up here. I'm just going to place it right up there. Ratchet. But right up there. I will just put my foundation just right here. Just because. Why not? And I'm, like I said, I'm going to put this on my vanity. But basically, that is it so simple so quick next week i will bring you guys into the collection again like i did last week i just wanted this week to be really really quick because honestly i need to shower so um i do plan on bringing in single blushes and bronzers and a highlighter palette next week i'm also going to keep on doing that i think that's what i'm going to do I think that each week I'm going to bring in a single shadow. So like the super shock shadows. But I think that when I go through them, I think I'm just going to bring in like a regular um, single shadow as well. Because they don't get enough use for me. But that is it. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And next week will be a better one. But I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Stay blessed. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.